Hi, I'm Peter Matheson, the Principal of the University of Edinburgh, and I'd like to extend a very warm welcome to our graduands and to their loved ones joining us virtually. I'm speaking to you today from the magnificent McEwen Hall here at the University of Edinburgh, where usually we would be hosting thousands of you in person over the course of a few weeks. Sadly, the hall is quiet this year as our traditional celebrations have not been possible in the current circumstances. This has been an incredibly difficult year for you all, and we're all very sorry that our students' experience has been so severely impacted by the pandemic. Words such as unprecedented may have been overused this year, but it's hard to see 2020 as anything other than a completely extraordinary year. All of our lives have been turned upside down by the coronavirus pandemic. Staff, students, alumni and friends of the University of Edinburgh have adapted, innovated, collaborated and worked hard in often very challenging circumstances. And the net result is that the university has continued to function, albeit in a very different way. And despite all of the difficulties, you have made it to this very special day, your graduation day. Your resilience and hard work has paid off and we offer you our most sincere congratulations. It is traditional at this point to acknowledge your achievements and the support that you've had with rounds of applause. I feel that this year should be no different and I'd like you, wherever you are and whoever is with you, to join me now to recognise three groups. First, today's graduates themselves, who, own, who have so much to be proud of, so many things to cherish about today. So be proud of yourselves, be pleased that you've completed your studies here at the University of Edinburgh and look forward to wherever you go next. The second group is the staff of the University, not just the academic staff who've taught you and mentored you and helped you over the years, but also all those behind the scenes too. Finally, we cannot forget your loved ones. For all the people who have supported you before you came to university, whilst you are here, and who will continue to support you in the future. This is their day as well, and many of them will have made sacrifices for you. All of them will be sharing in your joy at your graduation day. So please join me now in a round of applause for all these groups. As you leave today, you're at a stage of your education which I hope you don't consider an ending. This is just one step along the journey that you've embarked upon. I hope some of you will come back to the university to study for further degrees, or to be a teacher or researcher, or just come and visit us as alumni. Please stay in touch with us. We want you to be part of the University of Edinburgh family for the rest of your lives. To enable that, a few years ago, we launched a new platform which facilitates contact by allowing you to communicate with one another but also to communicate with your university. It's known as Platform One. There are now over 12,000 members, and please don't be nervous about approaching someone. After all, they are Edinburgh people just like you. Finally, I'd ask you to reflect on the person that you were when you first joined the University of Edinburgh and the person that you are today. Think about the new knowledge that you've acquired during that time, and think about the new friends and contacts that you've made. Please take that transformation which has happened to you whilst you've been here at the University of Edinburgh as evidence of the role that university education can play in your lives and indeed the lives of others. Whatever you do next, I wish you all the very best. It's now my great honour to hand over to our Chancellor, Her Royal Highness the Princess Royal, to say a few words. Many congratulations. Uh, to all of you again and have a wonderful day. By anybody's definition of the word normal, this has not been a normal year. However, for you reaching the end of your studies and graduating today, hopefully it is exactly as anticipated despite such a tumultuous period. The ceremony today may be virtual, but it still marks the recognition of the successful culmination of years of study for each of you. Your university student years are not just about achieving your degree. They allow you to experience new things and build many lasting friendships and relationships. 
today provides an opportunity to reflect on the good times enjoyed and the difficulties that have been overcome. Perhaps that last point has been particularly significant this year, which should make your achievements the focus of an even greater sense of pride. Your university has been a place of shared activities and goals, a forum for honest learning and scholarship, a community of friendship and encouragement. As a university, we acknowledge gratefully the constancy and support provided by your wider circle of friends and families, which, when you need it, you have been able to rely. Today also marks the beginning, a passage to new careers, an opportunity for further study, and a time for discerning where the future will now lead you. You will always carry something of these past years at Edinburgh. The memories of the sights and sounds of this city, perhaps quieter this year, but still significant. The friendships that will last and skills and knowledge acquired. As you move on to take your place in the worldwide community of Edinburgh graduates, we are very pleased to offer you our sincere congratulations and also our thanks for your contribution to the ongoing history of this university. By the authority vested in me, I now have the honour to admit to their various degrees and certificates those who are taking part in this virtual ceremony today. Congratulations, everyone. You've now learned an enormous amount of mathematics and statistics. You've reported it, you've presented it, and then you've told us all about it in your exams. I know that you've done this in what might be the hardest possible circumstances, a global pandemic and national lockdowns. And I know that you'll really have missed beautiful JCMB where you could sit side by side with your friends. But I just wanted to say to you and to everybody who might be sitting with you watching this, what an incredible achievement it is. You've stood up and taken whatever the world can throw at you and you've delivered. So congratulations on your degree. I hope that you have a fantastic summer and farewell on everything that you do in the future. Hello, I'm in, here in TV doing the pandemic properly. Uh, I've had a fantastic time at Edinburgh and sad to say goodbye. Well done to everyone graduating.
Hi there, Jim Dunlop here, uh, head of the School of Physics and Astronomy. And just on behalf of everyone in the school, I would like to congratulate you on successfully obtaining your degree in this hugely difficult year. It's fantastic you've managed to get through and graduate, whether it's with a BSc, an MPhys, or a PhD after three or four years of research. It's, graduation is always a fantastic achievement, and more so now than ever. Personally, I'd rather be meeting you on the stage in the McEwen Hall and congratulating you in person, uh, but that still isn't possible. Uh, I still hope, however, to see you and your families graduate in person and things return to normal. Um, just want to add, I'm proud of the way the school has reacted to the challenges posed by the pandemic. And although it's been a difficult year for many of you, I'm also proud of the way you've overcome the obstacles in your path. I hope somehow you can still manage to celebrate your graduation with your family and friends remotely if necessary. So once again, my warmest congratulations and my very best wishes for your future. All the best.
I would like to thank my family, my friends and the staff of the University of Edinburgh for making all of this possible. Lastly, I would like to congratulate everyone for making it this far and I wish for the very best to everyone. Hi, congratulations to all of you. Your graduation is a moment you never forgot. In your graduation day, you may always find new roads to travel, new horizon to explore, and new dream to call your own. Happy celebrations and congratulations again. Hello. Uh, I'm Dave Robertson. I'm the head of College of Science and Engineering. Um, firstly, uh, well done and congratulations. Um, you've got your degrees uh, in quite difficult circumstances, uh, given everything that we've been through um, with COVID and, uh, and everything that that entails. And you've done extremely well to get through. You're all at the pinnacle of your academic career. Um, uh, and you'll be thinking now about what you want to do in future. And the good news for you is in sciences and engineering and mathematics, you've never been more needed. Uh, as we go out of COVID, um, then we'll be rebuilding economies. We'll be doing more with science. I'm a computer scientist. Um, uh, computing science has been hugely important for keeping our communities together um, uh, and will be important in future as we, as we go through and, and rebuild. And this would also be true for the physical sciences and for mathematics. So you have huge opportunities and also huge responsibilities to society to help uh, rebuild and to do good in the world. Uh, so my message to you is uh, look forward to your future, help us to rebuild, and as I say, go out and do good in the world. Thank you. Hey everybody, I wanted to just be here today to wish you all the very, very best for what will be an amazing future for you all. And also to say thanks, thanks for sticking with us through an amazing period in your life, my life, and the university's life uh, over the last uh, 18 and 20 months or so. Um, it would be really great to be with you all in person. I really hope at some point in the near future we get to be together uh, in, in real time, in, in, in a real place. But in the meantime, have a great day. Uh, embrace everything that's wonderful about what your achievements respect, reflect, and, and give lots of hugs to all your family and friends. Take care. Bye-bye.